I think right now as I go into the offseason, my main goal is to potentially get called into the national team. I started thinking, you know, what's the next step for me and, and with the national team, that, that was the first thing that rang my bell, you know, that whole year last year, you see players getting into the national team, young players, getting brought in, getting chances, and I thought, you know, if I continue to play well right now, I'll get my chance eventually, and, and, and leading into January camp, that's how I felt, you know, that I got my chance and I had to take advantage of it. I felt the same exact way that I felt when I was getting my first camp with the youth national team. I was excited and I was nervous, and it was, it was a chance for me to prove myself and to prove everybody that that I have the quality to, to stay here and, and to play with the, the best of the best that the United States can offer. Of course, um, Greg told me you know, I didn't make the roster for the Gold Cup. I was really sad and emotional in, in that way, but, but I, I moved on. It helped me you know, motivate myself to, to be better and to perform well. And the next day, you know, Greg called me and said, hey, the man went down, uh, do you want it? And I was like, I was speechless at first, but, but of course, I was like, of course I want this. And, and I hung up and I just, I, my emotions were through the roof. Me and my friends were about to go to the mall, walk around a little bit, and Greg called me. And, and after, the, after that call, I told my friends right away, I was like, guys, like, I can't go to the mall. Went straight to the stadium to get my stuff. And then the next morning, I was with the team. And then this was my first opportunity to, to witness a final firsthand on the roster. And, and going from this national anthem to the American national anthem, I felt such a huge passion. and and love for, for my country like that. Jimenez brought it down. Jimenez Dos Santos in off the bar. It was coming from Mexico. There's the whistle. Mexico wins the Gold Cup. Collecting the second place, walking off with the, with the fireworks going off, it's just, it's just a really sad feeling that you, you never want to have. But you see a silver battle instead of a gold one. It's just like, OK. There's all this potential that we could uh, we could make make up for what we just did, and and just motivates you to do so much better. You know, I, I felt this in January camp when I came back, and just just the confidence that you have in yourself. You know, coming from from an environment where there's 23 guys fighting for for 11 spots only, and and it's the best of the best, and just every day is, is a grind basically, and. And you take that confidence that, that you have the ability to perform with this at this level and you bring it to your club team and, and you just feel like that you could control the world almost. <laughs> 